front and I was attacked by a, a very, very aggressive fox. Take one look at that Mary nice. Seaver's left ankle and you know she isn't happy. A fox bit the 69-year-old Brockton resident in the ankle in broad daylight as she was gardening in front of her Oak Street home Wednesday afternoon. She was adding mulch to these bushes near the sidewalk when the fox came up from behind and bit her. I could see it coming out of the corner of my left eye and I thought it was might be the neighbor's cat until of course he crunched onto me. So I screamed, of course nobody came. My husband was down in the cell watching television. So I grabbed him by the scruff of the neck and I opened his mouth and that's when he let go. I was going to go after him with the rake to see if I could do him in but... It's the second reported fox attack in the neighborhood in two days. It came at, right out of my neighbor's yard and it came and bit my lace on my skate and then, and then it just wouldn't let go. The fox teeth didn't break the skin, but it's pretty scary. Did your mom come and help you? So now you're afraid to go outside? Animal control officers set up traps to catch the fox. Uh, we've set a couple traps out. Hopefully we'll be able to trap the animal. We're going to distribute some flies to the residents in the area. So we're not sure if it's rabbit or not, or it might be uh, a mother fox that might have a litter of puppies that's protecting its den. Meanwhile, neighbors share their concerns about an aggressive fox still at large. What are you concerned about? Rabies. I don't know. You don't know what to... Animals guy. Why, why were not the neighbors in the area? Why was not there notification to all the neighbors that this was... From a local emergency room, Mary Seaver calls the mayor asking for increased fox patrols near her home. Her husband, Eugene, goes back to where the attack happened. Have you seen any foxes in the area? Never. We've had a couple of deer in the backyard, but other than that, never. He's among people keeping a close eye out for the fox. Yeah, I work nights. So are you going to be extra careful tonight? Oh, sure, certainly. I have to put my car inside of the garage and I need to get in, in there safe instead of leaving it outside. Then I have to alert my daughter when okay. she's coming tonight. Oh my God, I hope they're okay. In Brockton, Maria Papadopoulos, The Enterprise.